This is Dom from the Seven. I know we got a lot going on out there in many different parts of the world in terms of forefronts or areas where things can spark rather quickly. We have a situation in Ukraine that I think we need to pay attention to. This has been growing for a long time now. We have worked a massive attack against the Ukrainian government. And this is absolutely massive. We're talking close to 70 different federal and local Ukrainian government agencies. Past couple of weeks, and this whole thing is basically giving them and saying expect the worst. So warning people that across the board, they're not saying that they're going to make a big line or anything like that, going after infrastructure. And a lot of this is tied directly into the surrounding areas. Russia, obviously, there was an element to this. When everything broke loose during the Obama administration, Russia swooped down. Crimea, just like the base there in Sebastopol. All this hacking, some are saying this could very well be a prelude to an invasion. So, all the warning signs are out there. If they start to hit other targets connected to the infrastructure, especially communication, comms, the internet, things like that, when that goes down, then it's going down big time right behind them. So, this massive hack is just showing and demonstrating that this continues globally. They've hit all kinds of sectors. We've seen it here in the United States. They've hit our water supply lines. They've hit many government buildings, banks, colleges, you name it. It's only a matter of time before they bring this whole thing out to again. The Europe is planning a massive drill on doing what? On the whole entire dang thing going down. Writings on the wall. I hope you guys have a plan for implementing that plan. I'll talk about that more on the live stream, so make sure you join me Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern on D Live. Follow me on Twitter and Getter. You'll find links below. Hit that subscribe button for more. Wish you luck. Shalom, that's a um, Dabu 7 report relating to uh, massive hack 70 um, government agencies in Ukraine can signal invasion. I'll go to a few scriptures. Luke 18 and 7. Luke 18 and 7 For nothing is secret that shall not be made manifest neither anything hid that shall not be known or come abroad so anything secret is going to be eventually not be a secret no more anything hid is going to be um, um, made manifest and known Go to Proverbs 24. Proverbs 24 and 2. For their heart study of destruction, that's the wicked, and their lips talk of mischief, and that's deceit. So the wicked is always constantly studying destruction, man. 
I'm gonna read a few down. He that devises it to do evil shall be called a mischievous person. And that's what the wicked is, a very mischievous person. Because they're constantly just they're studying destruction and they're constantly have no rest as far as uh, fulfilling certain purposes that they want to fulfill, man. go to uh, Proverbs 4 and 16 for they sleep not except that they have done mischief so they don't they sleep for they sleep not you know they always studying to do certain things to have counsel to implement how to do it in this way or in this manner so they have no rest, man. They're sleeping and they have, they 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 don't have rest when it comes to uh, mischief, being uh, doing mischief, because they are a mischievous person, a person that's out to do harm, man. Let's read that again. For they sleep not, except that they have done mischief, and their sleep is taken away unless, in their sleep is taken away unless they cause some some to fall so their purpose is to um, fulfill um, their purpose where it affects a lot of people man. so they have no rest they have no sleep until that gets done man. Revelations 12 and 12 Woe unto the inhabitants in the earth and the sea for the devil's going to come in great wrath knowing he has but a short time, man. Go to um, let's read here. But the wicked are like the troubled seas when it cannot rest, whose water is cast up mire and dirt. So the, the wicked is like those troubled waves, man. Troubled waters, man. Constantly on, constantly on the move. Very um, turbulent, very um, um, unstable, and most of all, is not at rest, man. So that's the char that's the characteristics how the wicked are, man. I want to go to a word, uh, Blitzkrieg. Uh, relating to um, the cyber attacks, man. So that's another way, a form of um, neutralizing, stabilizing, um, to, uh, neutralizing, and um, pretty much uh, disabilizing the, um, your opponent, man. The Blitzkrieg is an intense military campaign intended to bring about swift victory. So it's a fast attack upon the enemy, man. Cyber attack could be that, that way. Cut communications. Cut forms of communications. Cut uh, forms of information going to and fro. Because the internet's that uh, form of what? It's the highway information, that unicorn. So, in the matter of speaking, it's a, a form of a, a cyber blitzkrieg, man. They could use that to, you know, to neutralize their, their opponent, man. I'm just saying. This is just an example. Now, Blitzkrieg is, um... That's, um, attack... That's a form of attack they used back in the World War II. 
you know, to uh, pretty much catch their guard, catch the um, the enemies in a semi-ready position, man, or catch them off guard when they least expect it. You know, it's a form of a fast attack. That was just a, sc a few scriptures relating to what I'm talking about. Um, about that. Um, I hope it, I hope it helps whoever listens. Um, this is Brother Zayab, um, which means wolf. I want to give all praise to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Rakakadash. Shawa, uh, Thawada, Shawa, thanks.